one time, I felt he was getting ready to argue with me. I, I could feel it coming on. Like, I could tell him the tension in his voice or if he's trying to make stuff up to argue about. So, in my eyes, I would just kind of ignore him. I would play Candy Crush on my phone, just zone him out, pray in my mind, or try to think about something else just to blur him out. Like the womp, 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 when you're a kid, I want to listen to your parents nag. And so, one time I did that, he reached and he snatched my phone out of my hand. And when I reached to grab it back, he took my arm, twisted it, pop, broke my bone. And when I felt it pop, I screamed. I was like, you broke my arm. And he was looking at me like, and I started to cry. And he like panicked, like, well, what, what, what did I do? And I'm like, take me to the hospital. He took me to the hospital. Um, they put a little split in a cat, like a temporary cast on it. Um, come to find out that he twisted it so hard that he detached the ligament from my bone. So I had to go in and have surgery. I had 15 staples in my arm and I have an anchor permanently put in my arm to keep my arm, to keep my bone attached to the ligament. Um, at that time, I didn't know that because of the medication that I was on caused me to have osteoporosis as well with my lupus. And so that's why my bone broke so easily. But had he not threatened my arm and twisted it, we would have never had to find that out. Um, another time, he punched me in my face. Um, it just got worse and worse. I, again, I'm, I'm a vocal girl. I never kept it a secret. I told. I would embarrass him every chance. He, you want to put your hands on me? I'm going to tell everybody. If you don't want nobody to know, don't do it. And so I, I, would, I would remember telling my friends, like, girl, I feel like I'm in a Lifetime movie. Like, because I know better, I knew what was going on. It's like, what are, what are you doing? But every time I would get ready to leave, he would cry. He threatened to kill himself before. I just need help. I, I'll go get the counselor. Whatever it is you want me to do, I'll go do. I'll go. He, I did go through one time uh, when he hit me. I called the police and made him go ahead. And he had to do anger management classes, court, you know, everything. When they got order protection, everything. And I still took him back. 